March Madness is heating up at the Division II level. Minnesota State Moorhead took their final shoot around at Ford Center today in Evansville, Indiana, before they take on 2011 NCAA Division II champions Bellarmine on Wednesday. Head coach Chad Walthall says the Dragons are prepared thanks to the tough regular season schedule they had. The Dragons have focused their efforts the past week on ball protection and rebounding, two areas Bellarmine has succeeded in all season. But the Dragons led the nation throughout the regular season with the fewest turnovers per game. Walthall says they've targeted the challenge in Bellarmine though and are ready for Wednesday. One of the big things for us is is uh, we're going to have to do a great job on the boards because they just they're so long and and, and so uh, uh, aggressive on the boards. We're going to have to do just a great job of blocking out and keeping you know their possessions to a minimum. This game only available on NCAA.com. A couple options for you to watch though. Head over to the Buffalo Wild Wings in Moorhead or the TV area in the Comstock Memorial Union on the MSUM cam campus. I'll also have highlights for you at 10 right here on Valley News Live. And with the program's best start ever under head coach Dave Haxtall this season, it became pretty clear pretty early that North Dakota men's hockey would be returning to the NCAA ice hockey tournament this year. With that, they were all but guaranteed a near home ice advantage with Shields Arena pre-selected as a regional location and UND set as the host. The travel accommodations for a Division I hockey team are anything but rough these days, though. And Haxtell says teams of this caliber, teams like Quinnipiac with a veteran squad, will be ready no matter how far the trip to Fargo from Connecticut is. North Dakota will be looking to use that like home ice advantage and recreate an atmosphere you would expect at the Ralph Ingolstadt Arena. But, you know, again, that's incumbent upon us going out and being ready to play and, uh, and you know, being able to, uh, to get that building uh, going a little bit. So, you know what, at this time of year, honestly, I don't think, you know, teams uh, are rattled by much. Um, you know, it's, it's game on. Despite tickets being sold out, North Dakota Champions Club is hosting an official UND pregame party at Fargo Billiards and Gastro Pub. Party will start three hours prior to any game UND is participating in all weekend. Those games available on ESPNU. Meanwhile,